Hello everybody, what is going on? Thank you for joining me for another episode of the Journey for the Enchanted Sword RPG. I am Bleaker. Obviously, you saw the stupid name underneath the channel, like, Hey, here's that fine fella. Let's watch his shit. And I'm like, okay. I blew that intro to bits. I'm... I am terribly, terribly sorry. I blew that to bits. Am I going to redo it? No, I'm too damn lazy to redo it. I'm too damn lazy to hit the F5 key, and instead I'm just going to rant about how I blew it while exploring this tree for free shit. Okay, that's enough of that. So, in the previous episode, we cleared the blues... Blues cave? Blues cave? Killed the spider queen, stopped her deadly rampage is through the city, and now we're going to go speak to our main man, Sullivan! Oop! I'm back! I beat the Spider Queen. Here's some web. Take it. You're, you're, Bach. I don't believe it. You, you've slayed the spiders. You have saved us. You have no words for your heroic deeds. I know, I'm awesome. All I can do is give you the items from the chest upstairs. Oh, and could you give this letter to Bleaker? You, you did just give the letter to Bleaker. Oh, right, right. NPC Bleaker. My bad, my bad. <laughs> oh, that makes me smile. That makes me that that little joke made me that that made me okay. I know I'm not funny. So we come up here. Where's the stuff upstairs? Ah, here's the stuff up. Holy crap! That is a lot of fresh unsliced, white unsliced. You're you're going in the. Need you. Spider's eye. I'm probably going to not need any of that. I need to go to the... Anything in here? Nice. Nice. That is why we check everywhere. Literally everywhere. I really need to go back and seri seriously reorganize my chest. But, okay. So, from here... We've already talked to Sullivan. Like he said, we have to go back to Bleaker's house. We have to go back to my Bleaker, my my house. Welcome to Market Town. That is a good place to shop if you've gotten this far in the game. I wonder if there's anything up here. Probably. If there is, I've probably already gotten it because I did do a little bit of. Nope, I'm just able to climb up there. My leg! Oh, while we're here, we might as well journey into that little tree house there. There's some stuff in there, and it never hurts to have more stuff, even though my chest is absolutely full, and I could probably do with a few less stuffs. Yeah, stuff! So I would like to thank everybody for their support thus far on the series. This is honestly the... This has just been amazing. Like, I am pretty happy with the way things are turning out and how the series is progressing thus far. It's just going to nickel and dime us. Nope, nothing in there. Nope. Oop. Nice. Cookie. Star. Money. Is that it? I swore there was an upstairs. That is deceptive. Oh, there's the ups there's the up ladder. I mean, I'm sorry, up ladder. I I'm sorry, I misspoke. Okay. I have an enchanting table. I have seven levels that I can't use. Lame. Nice. Anything else? Nope. No! <laughs> oh, come on. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. You guys can visit there. I'm going back to Bleaker's house. What's this about? Boneyard Dungeon. Oh, right. Um, don't really need that yet. Quick travel book. I want to go to Pumpkin Island. If you ever get that issue, that's how you fixed it. Let's go to Pumpkin Island. Sandy Cove District. Um, shoot, now I'm lost. 
set the spawn point here. Ken Island, Sandy Cove District. Ah! My house. This right here is my house. So, Message for you, sir. Well done, as promised. Take these from the NM. Upstairs, climb the ladder. Okay. Yay! What a bro, that guy. Remember, two chests. Okay, now we have Pelfer's chest key. Okay, that's important, but I can't quite remember why. Oh, well. Keep you near the moldy dungeon. Is there a chest around here that I can deposit my loot from? There probably isn't. Okay, so I'm just going to take a brief pause in the recording here. I'm going to head back to the family vault. Kind of sort through my inventory here and get rid of all the extra... Oh, I hope my book helps you. Could you give that key to Telfer when you go there? He must have dropped it when he was at the farm last time. Anyways, good luck finding the Greed Orb. Now you are a knight, it should be easy. Thank you. You're a lot less cynical than I am, Bleaker. Nice job. So I'm going to take a brief pause in the recording here because I need to honestly sort through my inventory. So hang tight. I'll be right back. Okay, inventory kind of sorted here. This is kind of what I got going on here. I'm going to keep as much money, some arrows, these boneyard chests. This is important, I've discovered. Uh, I've got my books in here, armor and other weapons in here. All the potions I have collected, holy shit, there's a lot. And then I've got, uh, you know, just some useless crap in my food. Yeah, my food's the useless crap. So let's go to Telfer's house. Anytime now, we could go to Telfer's house, and I would be okay. There we go. So this is Telfer's house. We are roughly... Um, the Moldy Dungeon's over that way. So I think we're actually north of Castletown? Let's see, if that way is Castletown, we are... We are actually north of Castletown. So... Did you just come through the door? No, I magically teleported in. Oh, I technically did. Damn it, I feel like a dick. You have freed me, fine sir. Cool. Um, If you look around this part of the island, you'll find the moldy dungeon. There's a chest upstairs that has an item you need, but I dropped the key when I was at the farmhouse near Bleaker's house. Maybe Bleaker found the key. Damn straight Bleaker found the key. Yeah, so, ah, this is important. A poem for you. Now, this is our newest item. This allows us to cut through Arcania, f Arcania fences? I can never pronounce worth a damn. In the cemetery there lies an enchanted blade, but, only, but one can only enter if they have the wooden spade. Now, that, as obscure as that is, that is an important thing to note. Now, I will explain why that is important when the time comes. That is going to be, we're getting down to the second half, I believe, of the playthrough. When we enter into that Boneyard dungeon. We're actually going to get some pretty good loot here. So, now I'm going to show you guys where the Moldy Dungeon is. And then I'm going to cut the recording there. So, this is the back of Telfer's house. So, we've, we're at Telfer's house right here. And we TP'd near the Moldy Dungeon. This is about where you'll TP. The Moldy Dungeon is over here. That's it. The Moldy Dungeon is right here. Beware full of danger. Yes, I am very aware it is full of danger. And over there, I believe that's... Crow's Palace, if I remember correctly. I re probably don't. Oh yeah, Crow's Keep. Look at that. So, I'm going to do... So, I still have a few minutes, but I don't want to get started on the Moldy Dungeon. So, we're just going to like take a look around here and see if we can't find some chests... That might help you guys out. I never did very much of the side questing or looking around and exploratorying. So this is going to be kind of a new area for me as well. I never went over this part very well. Near Keep Castle Town, near Town Breezeway. This okay. So what's around here? Hmm. That doesn't seem sketchy at all. We have. Oh, this is actually a cool thing. Once a day, you get to pick a chest. And there could be good loot in the chest. It's actually pretty cool. 
See, I win. That was the right choice. Oh, and if you pick another one, it's a trap chest. Yeah, it's it's actually kind of cool. And you get to do that once a day. I tried it once, it I failed. I I picked the trap chest. I don't know if that option switches or if it's going to be the same chest every day. This is honestly the first time I got it. I actually have been in this area a little bit, side questing. Over here is the Manor of Commerce. That's kind of cool. You can do trades and stuff there. A neat little place. Castletown, Breezeway, Town, Breezeway. I don't quite remember this area very well. What is over here? Well, this looks important. Aha! Free money. Money, money, money. Free money. Neat. Now, I, around here there's a tree that you can actually go and fight stuff and get some loot. Where is that tree? That tree right there. We're actually going to go into that tree right there. So, I believe that's the Chamber of Commerce. That's Telfer's house over there. We're going to be heading here anyways because we have to go to Mirror Town to get some stuff. But this is kind of a cool little do thingamajigger. Where is it? There it is. Into the roots of the gnarled old tree. We descend deep into the earth to fight foes that the world has never seen before. Trust me, there's more here. <clears throat> Shink, I win. There's some stuff down here. I don't quite remember what you get for kicking this place's butt. I'm pretty sure it was good. I'm pretty sure we got good loot. I know there's a whole bunch of demon knights in here. Hello. Eh. Oh wait, these are undead. Oh, these are just skeletons in armor. Undead sword. Nice. Now what? Um. Pretty sure something's supposed to. The button. Something's supposed to spawn. Please? Something spawn? No? Okay. Secret cave chest. Because I know there was... There's stuff... Oh, there it is. There's the thing that I need. Do I have arrows? I do not have arrows. Um, is there... Well, there's not. You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Nothing at all. You saw nothing. Don't tell Mick. Oh, right. Heavy sword. This thing can kill things in mo- This is the better sword. I win. Come on, Lady Luck, what do you got for me? A door. Another door. A another door? There it is. The Arachnid Slayer. Slay spiders and bugs quickly. This sword is old and damaged. It will eventually break. That would have been actually very handy <laughs> earlier in the play. That would have been handy really in the last playthrough. Well, um, guys, I'm afraid that's all the time I have. Um, use this knowledge to your advantage. Oh. Right. Not dealing with this today. Losers. But when we come back next time, guys, we will uh, we will clear the moldy dungeon. Um, I can't remember how big that one is. Probably clear it in its entirety. I'm not sure. But uh, I hope you guys find these playthrough to be helpful and such. If you guys want me to specify on anything or anything specific in the game that I have not yet, direct me to the coordinates, tell me about where it's at, and I will make an absolute mockery of myself doing it. So, until next time, guys, this has been Bleaker. Be seeing ya.